I am a made entrepreneur. I'm not a born entrepreneur. And I am the founder and CEO of a company called AGM Marketing. I am a Facebook certified professional and one of the few official certifications in the Facebook advertising world. So I know what's working. I know the strategies that work. And I don't know which ones don't work as much as they used to before. Let me tell you a story about myself. myself, myself, myself. I had a miserable young adulthood and I consider myself to be a loser. I definitely was not interested in school. That was not my thing. And because I was not interested in it, I used to feel that I was a failure myself. I was a good tennis player and that was my obsession. I used to get out of school and go play tennis. My tennis career in Puerto Rico by the age of 12, I was the number one player in the country and I was in the top 25 in the United States, but I ruined it afterwards. I got connected with very bad environments. meaning there were a lot of drugs. And I got influenced by all that stuff and I got carried away. That was a big part of my life. From the ages of teenage years of 12 or 13, all the way to 20, I had a really tough time in my life. I was unhappy, I was a part of bad groups, and I was not doing well in life. So for about five, six years of my life, I was broke for a long time. I didn't have any money. I lived in Mexico City with my wife and I didn't have 20 pesos to my name at some point. I couldn't buy myself tacos and a Coke in the corner. So I know what it is to not have anything. Literally bankruptcy, 2007, coming to the United States. And in 2014, I didn't know what direction my life was going to. I didn't even know how to generate more income. So I became a waiter for many years. When I was 32, I looked back and I realized that all the things that happened in the past were just in the past. And then my future was in my hands and I could do something about it. Ever since 2007, I've been trying to find a way, something that I felt passionate about. So the way that I actually started shifting everything that was going on in my life, that I didn't have enough survival, just five years ago, was that I decided to learn obsessively. I decided to learn about what was going on. And I found it in marketing, I, guess I was lucky. I guess that I was- I got really lucky because I decided to get really good at, not intentionally, on the subject of advertising and on the subject of social media. I got started by listening to people that I trusted, that I admired, that I respected for years and I learned from them and by me listening to them I got to implement some things that I know they were implemented successfully and I saw results myself. I did not expect to get so many realizations and so many uh, overall visions as to our future is that there's always room for improvement and uh, if you stay connected with the right people you're going to keep on growing regardless of what you're doing no matter what you want to take yourself to the next level and you want to be connected with the right people consistently. But I started with the Amazon world myself, and then I branched out into other areas and marketing overall. And once I learned a little bit about it, I became obsessed with the Facebook opportunity. And I understood that that's the way the world was gonna start communicating from now on. And I wanted to make sure that I got really good at it. Because I am a marketer. My obsession is capturing attention. Even though I have a lot of activity, I always force myself to at least 20% of my day be learning something new. Because if I don't, I know that's going to be the end of my expansion. My wife and I have been working hard, countless hours, sacrificing vacations, activities, weekends, life with the kids, all kinds of things along the way to have what we have. And in 2016, I created an agency, which is called AGM Marketing. I am the founder and the CEO of one of the fastest digital agencies in the United States. And today we generate hundreds of thousands of dollars. So we went from 10 staff in January 2018 to 52. What? So from 10 human beings working for the company full time to 52 in a matter of 11 months. I'm currently spending over half a million dollars in Facebook advertising. We're doing close to $2 million of monthly revenue through Amazon. I had just taken on my dad as a customer who right now is a major social media superstar with my help. I took my dad's business from being one country in Puerto Rico, and now we're not only in one country, we are in eight countries. Dr. Eric Berg, he has a big following. He is the king of the ketogenic diet right now around the world. 500,000 people on Facebook, hundreds of thousands on Instagram. 
We got a community in Messenger of 600,000. Messenger happens to be a channel that I built from scratch. The number one health and fitness messenger platform on the planet. Not in the US, on the planet. I don't usually brag too much, okay? I built the number one health and fitness channel on the world. I did the copy for it. I built the entire chatbot. I built a systems on it, all of it. A few years ago, I was bankrupt just 12 years ago, and now I'm generating millions. Most people don't understand what it is. They don't understand this world yet. So again, in my end, there's a lot of work to be done. I gotta keep on waking people up. You know what I realized the other day? That's my job, Scott. That's my job. My job is to wake people up.